University of Michigan Board of Regents is now calling for one of their own members to resign this morning. Regent and Michigan Republican Party Chairman Ron Weiser is under fire for a speech last month. In it, he called Governor Gretchen Whitmer, Attorney General Dana Nessel, and Secretary of State Jocelyn Benson the three witches. He also said the only way to remove Congressman Peter Meyer and Fred Upton from office would be through voting or assassination. This morning, as the board asked for his resignation, Weiser said while he is sorry for his comments, he will not be canceled. I take full responsibility for what I said, and I am sorry and regret my poorly chosen words that were offhand remarks made at a private Republican Party meeting. Michigan Republican Chair and U of M Regent Ron Weiser apologizing during a special board meeting via Zoom Friday morning, calling for his resignation. I agree with part of this resolution, but I will not resign. I pledge to be part of a respectful dialogue going forward and challenge my colleagues and others to do the same. I will not be canceled. Weiser immediately signing off after his statement, leaving the other board members to read their comments to each other for the rest of the nearly 40 minute meeting. If any of us leading this university fan the flames of hate and division, that is a betrayal of our work and everything the University of Michigan stands for. The board's vice chair, Jordan Acker, especially fired up about Weiser's comments. And this sort of violent, sexist, dehumanizing language has no place in our politics, period. Acker says the fact that Weiser didn't stick around shows that he is truly not sorry. I, I don't believe in cancel culture. I believe that everybody deserves respect and everyone deserves the ability to atone for what they did wrong. It's actually the most American thing we have is learning to apologize and accept apologies. But accepting an apology and really being sorry doesn't call for you to say, I'm sorry, goodbye. It requires you to hear from the people that you hurt and to really show why what you did was wrong and to work to fix it with those communities. Michigan GOP Communications Director Ted Goodman says Weiser has sincerely apologized and will not be leaving his post. He expressed, you know, that he could have used some some different words. He's, he has he has said he's sorry uh, for for anyone that he's heard with, with that language. And he loves the University of Michigan. Um, he's done so much to support it. And it's just really unfortunate uh, to see other members, some members on the board uh, try and turn this into some, you know, sort of uh, personal political game. As far as attacking Congressman Meyer and Upton, Goodman says those comments were taken out of context. He was making it very clear that in this country, in the United States of America, where we value democracy uh, and, and each individual's voice, um, the way to make change is through a primary process. He was pointing out that in this country, the only way to change up leadership, if you're not happy with your elected officials, is to vote them out. And that was the point he was making. The board voting 501, encouraging resignation. But because they can't legally remove him from office, Weiser will have to step back on his own, if at all. Regent Weiser should go back and do some really hard thinking. And the thinking is, what do I love more? Um, my pride and ego, or do I love the University of Michigan? And I think that if Regent Weiser does that and he finds that he loves the university the most, he'll do the right thing and resign himself. And we have reached out to Ron Weiser for comment, but have not been able to contact him. Board President Denise Illich has removed him from his positions on the Finance Committee and the U of M Dearborn Committee. Acker says that they will continue to wait for his resignation, going on to say that it will be very hard for Weiser to be an effective member of the board should he still refuse to step down.